Hello everyone, today we are going to create an animation loop with just two artboards. Uh, as you see, there is a slight delay uh, at the end of each loop, but uh, since this is for prototyping and demonstration purposes, we're not going to mind it that much. So uh, let's start uh, creating it. I actually copied the uh, first artboard beforehand. Uh, one of the key points that we need to consider is since we are going to create a continuous animation of clouds, we need to copy this group of clouds we have and group it with our existing clouds. To be able to create a seamless loop, the animation needs to and in the loop it started. So I'm going to copy this artboard and paste it here vertically because I have a, a very long group of clouds. So I'm sure they are at the very back in the layer order. So I already uh, marked the uh, horizontal position of the uh, clouds so i'm going to drag it so this is the look the animation started and um, the second thing that we need to animate is our uh, plates of the wind turbine we have here but i grouped it with a circle to uh, to be able to rotate it uh, based on the center i want it to to be rotated because uh, let's uh, delete the circle at the very background and see what happens as you may guess, uh, the rotation animation is going to be in the center of this rectangle, uh, the width and height of uh, the group of blades have. But uh, by adding a circle in the very background that has the center of these blades have, I'm making it possible these blades to be animated uh, based on the center I want. So yeah, uh, that's another key point to consider. So in the second artboard, I also want these blades to be rotated by 360 degrees, right? So the rest is just uh, connecting these two artboards in finding the uh, action or animation types. So uh, from first output to second output, since I want uh, I want elements to be animated, uh, I'm selecting the auto animate uh, as action type. And, uh, I'm gonna leave the easing at none because I want uh, my animation to be as seamless as possible uh, and I'm gonna set the duration to something like 3 seconds and from the second artboard to the first one I need to just rewind my animation so uh, I'm going to set the duration to 0 seconds uh, and that way hopefully <laughs> I'm going to be able to uh, create a seamless animation loop. And actually, uh, I can refine that a little bit to make sure that the second group of clouds. Um, has the very same position with the first artboard, right? So this way it should be. Yeah, 
yeah, uh, this way it should be more seamless. 